Hi guys, I'm Marete Villato here the Basement Production. What I'm going to be doing today is as a, an old DIY project. Uh, I'm going to be removing the cork around the, the bathtub. Uh, it, it's, it's time to remove it, to replace it, to put a new one. It's kind of old, it's kind of even got dirty a little bit. I'm also going to be grouting the tiles as you can see. Uh, it fall out, so I'm going to grout it again. I'm going to try to do uh, the best I can. Uh, I'm not an expert on this. Uh, disclaimer, I'm not an expert, I'm not showing you how, how to do things, I'm just, uh, I'm just showing you how I do it. When you don't know what you're doing, uh, once you start doing something, ideas start flowing. The first thing that, I, that I'm doing, I got my, my knife, this right here. So be very careful with this, very careful. It's open, and I'm going to start removing the, the, the cork all around the top, so I could go ahead and, 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 and replace it with no corking. So I hope you enjoy it. As always, don't forget, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to share, like my videos, and uh, support the channel. Okay, so stay tuned. Here we go. Let's, let's start rock and rolling. Be very careful with this. This is very dangerous. What I'm going to do is I'm going to remove the cord. See when you watch when you watch YouTube channels, YouTube YouTube videos, uh, when uh, YouTubers explain to you how they do things, you know most of these videos they've been edited. We edit all these videos so it won't take that long, and we just want to show you no, most of the time the end result. Uh, nothing is easy when you do things. Just take your time, be careful, and eventually you're gonna get it done. Okay, even though we're replacing this, we still look, it look easy. It, I'll be honest with you, it's not difficult. But it's not as easy as it looks. You have to be careful with the knife. You have to uncork all that area. You have to clean it, wipe it down, then apply the new cork. Uh, you, you have to know how to, how to slice open at 43, 45 degree angle, the cork new uh, bottle. It's, it's a whole process. So when you see videos on YouTube, uh, the end result of it, and, and normally, like I said, this video has been edited. So just take your time and don't go crazy. Just take your time when you do things. Uh, so that's what I'm doing right now. I'm not an expert, I'm just taking my time and eventually I'm gonna get it done. So stay tuned for more, I'm gonna tell you that total business production. Always wipe, wipe your, your, your area, clean it, so you, you, so you, you will have, when you apply the new cork, when you apply the new cork, you will have a better grip. Make sure the, the area is dry. The towel is loose. It's not good. It's not looking good, guys. The towel is not looking good. You can see the hole. I'm going to try to save it. I'm going to try to clean it. Put it back together because I don't have another choice. This is just a quick fix for the moment. Okay, guys, now I'm going to try to remove this side. Uh, same process, just be careful, cut it out, cut the, the cork out. Just 
Just be careful you don't mess up, you don't scratch the stuff. There you have it guys. I went up removing all those back tiles because it's, it's very bad back there. We're going to have to redo the whole thing, but not today. That will be a video for another time. Uh, I went up uh, taking the cork out of the whole bathtub. Everything going to be cleaned up. Everything going to be Clorox. Everything going to be clean. Going to look super good. So stay tuned for more. Or by the time the basement production. See guys, I am, right now I am putting the new, not the new, I'm just, Putting the tile back. Like I said, this is just a temporary solution. Guys, since it's, it's I'm an expert, I'm using glove because you know, I'm just trying to do the best I can with this. Hopefully, we get it done. Hopefully it will work out. As you can see guys, I just put the whole thing there. I'm gonna clean it. When you don't know what you're doing, once you start doing something, ideas start flowing, you know? I'm gonna, I'm gonna when, it's, when it dries, I'm gonna, I'm gonna um, grout it, I'm gonna cork it. And it's gonna do super good. Okay, guys, I'm gonna finish. I'm gonna finish everything up now. I'm gonna start corking my corners. This is the this is the what I got. I don't know if you could read it. It's for kitchen, bath, and plumbing. Uh, there's uh, there's there's some more out there, more expensive ones. I mean, this like I said, this is a temporary job. I'm not gonna go spending extra money. I also went ahead and bought me a cork cork gun because I don't know what I did with mine so I'm just gonna bring it up this is simple for those of you guys who don't know how to use this just open it up it's a click right here where you could press and release pull your your cork right there twist it push it in and uh, start corking but before you do that this uh, point right here you have to cut it at a 40, 45 degree angle uh, normally, as you can see, this cork machine has a cutter right there. So you could, right there, you, you could see it. So you could cut your your point at a 40 degree angle. Like I said, I'm a DIY guy. I don't, I'm not an expert on this. Uh, I mean, I'm just trying my best. So I'm gonna try to cut it the way they, they indicate it. Let's see what happens. I think it came out pretty decent. There you have it guys. I'm gonna wait until it dries. I'm gonna grout it and I'm gonna show you that part. Uh, it was probably gonna take like a few hours. Normally he said it would dry in 30 minutes. Uh, I don't know about that. But anyway, uh, I'm gonna wait until it dry, everything dry. So I could uh, put some uh, grout in here and hopefully we're ready to go. Okay guys, I'm gonna perform the final steps uh, of this procedure. You can see this is the grout. I'm gonna grab my those tiles right there. Hopefully it works. I'm gonna use my trial, a rubber trial, and we're gonna help for the best. So let's see. Let's see how it goes.
No, normally this is not the way you do it. You normally have to do this. We'll see my my growl is uh got harder on me. It's no longer serviceable, it's no longer usable. I'm just trying to do the best I can with what I have. Okay, what you're supposed to have is you're supposed to have like a yellow sponge, a big one so you can wipe it out. I don't have that at the moment, so like I said, I'm improvising here. I'm improvising, I'm gonna wet this a little bit, I'm gonna clean the the edges, not too much, not too wet, so you won't get it out. I just want it, I just want this to get hard on, on it. So like that tomorrow we could take a shower. And that's about it guys. I'm gonna clean it up. That's gonna leave it ready for tomorrow and hopefully down the line in a, in a month or so if this stuff holds up, uh, we're gonna do the whole bathroom. Uh, once again, on my TV laptop version production, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to hit the notification bell. Uh, if you have a better method, leave it down in the comments. Remember, this is a DIY project. I'm not an expert. I'm just doing what I need to be done. Once again, I'm going to do it like Todo Vision Production.